I'm Ben with the BTC Sessions, and this is your bullish bit brought to you by Cedor.io, one of the most beautifully designed and robust options when it comes to backing up your seed phrase in solid steel. You can check them out at the links down below. So we use two layers of encryption for what we call distributed backups, backups yeah. that are two of three, mm -hmm. you know, up to four of seven. The top layer is the one with the passphrase. Okay. And that is AES-256 with Argon2 as a key derivation function. Okay. It's very resistant to brute force attacks. Brute forcing a, a five word passphrase is about $10.5 billion. So that we, we make sure that people with large, like very large holdings yeah. can, can use this. Um, the reason why we have the top layer, and I'll get to Shamir, is we don't want to do the same as what Ledger did with Ledger Recover. Yeah. Where you can subpoena two institutional custodians and have access to the holding. Yeah. Like the idea with the passphrase is the top layer will protect you from this. Yeah. You'll have to get to a human that is part of your governance team. But that's not very resilient. Okay. For that, Shamir comes into play. And Trezor has a nice implementation. I think it's slip 39. Yeah. Where it will generate, you know, a backup in clear text. But that allows you to not no longer have one piece of paper with something you have like two or three or whatever. Yeah. Um, so Shamir, which is quantum resistant, allows you to establish a scheme where you need X of Y secrets or shares in order to recover. Mm -hmm. And that has very interesting properties that are very similar to uh, multi-sig yeah. with a lot less complexity. So I think a lot of people are abusing multi-sig for personal self-custody, mm. adding a lot of complexity. And I think we'll see a lot more people losing their Bitcoin mm because of over complex you know having over complexified the system yeah if you you know the the old keep it simple stupid kind of thing it, like it, that exactly yeah. so i'm i'm just going in my bag cuz an image is always very insightful um, so this is what we call blocks essentially mm -hmm. uh, and this is a one of one yeah but you can generate a two of three okay people are really good at understanding the idea of this is important, I should not lose it. Yeah. They're very bad at cryptography, finding passwords, yeah. all the rest. Yeah. So what we really like in the context of Superbacked is we've made it something physical yeah. that will survive the test of time yeah. more than any flash memory. And really the crux of it is how do you generate the blocks? And for that, we have the secure operating system. It's not perfect in the sense of user friendliness, yeah. but it is insanely robust. Yeah. And, and that's what we, we believe is, is really mission critical. So it has Shamir. Mm -hmm. uh, so you get to have two of three blocks. Yeah. Um, and it's simple. If you have two of three blocks and a passphrase, you're in.